Assalamu alaikum. This is Nomad Arshad from Ali Trainings. Today we are going to solve language search reading P2 level test 1 part 4. In the previous videos we solved three parts but today we are going to solve part 4. Part 4 is the last part of this test. Here are some of the questions and we have to find our answers from the paragraph of the Panama Canal. They are saying that use a maximum of five words for each question. It means that we cannot use more than five words. So let's try to find our answer. Our first question is which part of South America did Balboa want to avoid? So which part of South America? It means we are looking for a part. Uh, we are looking for the part of America where Balboa want to avoid, where Balboa did not want to go. So let's try to find the Panama Canal is a vital shipping lane linking the Atlantic and Pacific Ocean. Opened in 1914, it was one of the greatest engineering projects of the modern age. However, the concept of a canal through the Isthmus of Panama, a comparatively narrow strip of land linking North and South America, had been thought of as far back as the 16th century. When the Spanish explorer Vasco Nunes de Balboa led an expedition across the Isthmus of Panama in 1513. He saw the potential for a passage that would allow access from sea to sea without having to navigate around Cape Hornet. So in this paragraph, this is the area Cape Hornet uh, from the South America where Balboa did not want to go. He wanted to avoid because he saw the potential for a passage that would allow access from sea to sea without having to navigate. It means that he can go anywhere in the sea without having the navigation so that is why he did not have to go to Cape Hornet so so the answer of the first question is Cape Hornet so Cape Hornet shall be written in here in this section second question is what was Charles V told about his plan for a canal so let's see where is the Charles V here in 1534 Charles V, King of Spain, formally ordered further investigation into the possibility of the construction of a ship canal across the isthmus. The surveyed route followed to a large extent the course of the present day Panama Canal. However, the governor politely informed Charles V that the undertaking of such an engineering operation was impossible. So this was the statement that has been informed by the government to the Charles V that Whatever he is going to do, he informed him that your operation was impossible. So, we shall write our answer that it was impossible. So, Charles V told about his plan for a canal that it was impossible. Question number three. What did Malaspina do to show the canal could be built? So, let's see where is the Malaspina. Not until the late 18th century was a new Panama Canal construction project given much serious thought. This was when the historic 1789-1794 scientific expedition led by Alessandro Malaspina landed in Panama. By actually, uh, by actually planning the excavation of the Panama Canal, Malaspina was able for the first time to demonstrate the feasibility of such a huge project. So he demonstrated about such a huge project that planning the excavation. He planned the excavation about that huge project and he demonstrated that planned the excavation about that huge project. So we shall write our answer in here that he planned the excavation. Question number four, what made the crossing of Panama easier in the 19th century? So what was the thing what happened in the 19th century that made Panama easier, uh, that made crossing the Panama easier? So let's try to figure it out. Let's try to find. Overland links continued on the isthmus of Panama, facilitated by the construction of a railway in 1855. Okay, in 1855, facilitated by the construction of a railway. So it means that it facilitated by construction of a railway. The construction of railway made it easier to cross the Panama. So that is why the answer of uh, answer of the question number question number four is construction of a railway. So construction of a railway that was the thing that made it easier to cross the Panama. Question number five: What important political development occurred in 19th century? So in the 19th century, what happened about the political development? Let's see. Let's see. 
By then, Panama was free of Spanish colonial rule, but the idea of a water route through the Isthmus of Panama had not been forgotten. Okay, this was the political development that happened. Spanish colonial rule has ended. Uh, at that time, in 1855, uh, by the 19th century, the Spanish rule ended. So, we shall write in here, uh, <clears throat> important political development, Spanish rule ended. Or you can also write, colonial rule ended. Question number 6. How long did the French attempt at canal construction last? A new phase in the history of the Panama Canal was beginning. In 1882, a French company under the renowned engineer Ferdinand de Lesseps, who had earlier built the Suez Canal, finally set about the construction. Their attempt was disaster. Malaria and yellow fever killed most of the workforce. Equipment failed in the heat and humidity, and geological and hydrological consideration were badly managed. Uh, the project was abandoned in 1889 at the expense of over 20,000 lives. So it started from 1882 and it ended in 1889. So our answer is from uh, answer is 1882 to 1889. You can write 1882 to 1889. You can also write from uh, 1882 to 1889. It's a time period of seven years. So it means you can also write seven years so seven years is also a good answer for the question number six question number seven what happened to the french company okay what happened the construction of the panama canal would finally be realized when the united states during the presidency of theodore roosevelt bought out the french company its equipment and excavations Work began in 1904 and the Panama Canal was finally opened in 1914. So what happened to the French company? It was actually bought by the United States. Here it has clearly shown that United States bought out the French company. So you can write US, uh, sorry, you can write USA bought out the French company or you can also write America bought out the French company. So the answer of the question number seven is USA port out. This is the end of language start reading P2 level test 1 part 4. We have completed our test 1. I hope that you liked the video. If you like it, press the like button and subscribe our channel. We shall meet again in the next video. Till then, goodbye.